for the poor old man. A penny for a poor old man. A penny for a poor old man. Music. So it is not a dream. At last, nor a vision. They are mute and I am mute before them. Poor wretch. Now I may go back. The mystery is over. Unless we join together and live together till death ensue. What would you say to that, Billy? May I call you Billy like my son? Do you like company, Billy? Do you like tin food? Billy. What tinned food? Corn beef, Billy. Just corn beef. Enough to keep body and soul together until summer. With care. No. A few potatoes, too. A few pounds of potatoes, too. Do you like potatoes, Billy? We might even let them sprout, and when the time came, we could put them in the ground, and we might even try that. I would choose a place and you would put them in the ground. No? How are the trees? Hard to say. It's winter, you know. Is it day or night? Oh, day. No sun, of course. Then you wouldn't have asked. You follow my reasoning? Have you still your wits about you, Billy? Have you still some of your wits about you? But light! Well, yes, yes, light. There's no other word for it. Shall I try to describe this light to you? Would you like me to give you some idea of this light? It seems to me sometimes I spend the night here playing and listening. I used to feel twilight gather and make myself ready. Okay. I put away a feet little and bowl and had only to get to my feet when she took me by my hand. She? My woman. A woman. But now. Now. When I set out here, I don't know. When I get here, I don't know, and while I'm here, I don't know whether it's day or night. You were not always as you are. What befell you? Women? Gambling? God. Who is always as I am. Come. Who is always as I am, crouched in the darkness, and scratching an old jungle to the four winds. We had our women, hadn't we, Billy? You yours to lead you by the hand and I mine to get me out of the chair in the evening and put me back in the morning and push on to the corner when I went out of my mind. Cripple, poor wretch. Only one problem, the about turn. I often felt as I struggled that it would be quicker to go on right round the world till one day I realized I could go home backwards. For example, I am at A. I push on to B. I return to A. The straight line, the vacant space, do I begin to move you? Sometimes I hear steps, voices. I say to myself, they coming back. They coming back to try and settle again or to look for something that left behind, or someone that left behind. Come back. Who would want to come back here? And you didn't call out, 
Cry out. No. Have you observed nothing? Me, you know, observe. I sit there in my lair, in the chair, in the dark, 23 hours out of the 24. What would you have me observe? You think we would make a match now that you're getting to know me? A corned beef, did you say? Apropos, what have you been living on all this time? You must be famished. There are things lying around. Edible? Sometimes. Why don't you let yourself die? On the whole, I've been lucky. The other day, I tripped over a sack full of nuts. No. A sack, a little sack full of nuts in the middle of the road. Yes, all right, but why don't you let yourself die? I have thought of it. But you don't do it! But I'm not unhappy enough. <laughs> That was always my unhappy. But I'm not unhappy enough. But you must be every day a little more so. But I'm not unhappy enough. If you ask me, we were made for each other. What does it all look like now? Oh, me, you know, I never go far. Just a little up and down before my door. I never pushed on to here till now. But you look about you. Oh, no, no. After all the hours in the darkness. No! Of course, if you wish me to look about me, I shall. And if you care to push me along, I shall try to describe the scene to you as we go along. You mean you guide me? I'd never get lost anymore. Exactly. I'd say, easy, Billy. Turn back and we'll lift when I give you the word. You do that? Easy, Billy. Easy. I uh, see a round tin over there in the gutter. Uh, perhaps it's soup or baked beans. Baked beans? Are you beginning to like me, Billy? Or is it only my imagination? Baked beans? What are you? Here, dear fellow. Stop! It's a gift. It's a gift. Stop! Forgive me, Billy. Forgive me. Where am I? Where was I? Oh, I've lost him. He was beginning to like me. And I struck him. Now he leave me and I'll never see him again. I'll never see anyone again. We'll never hear the human voice again. Did you hear enough of it? It's the same old moaning groans from the cradle to the grave. Do something for me, Billy, before you go. There. Did, did you hear it? I can't go. Did you hear it? You can't go. Can't go without my things. What use are they to you? None. And you can't go without them? No. I'll find them in the end, or leave them forever behind me. Straighten my rug before you go. Do that for me, Billy. I'd do it, but it would take too long. Do that for me, Billy, before you go. Then I may say, I have seen man for the last time. I struck him and he succored me. Find a few rags of love in my heart and die, reconciled with my species. Why are you gaping at me like that? Have I said something I shouldn't have? What does my soul look like? Make a sound. You no sense of smell either. It's the same stink everywhere. <laughs> am, I with, am I within the reach of your hand? Wait, don't tell me you're not going to do me a service for nothing. I mean, unconditionally. Good God. Your foot. What? You said your foot. Yes, my foot. On your knees, on your knees, you'll be more at your ease. 
Let go of my hand. You want me to help you when you hold my hand? Have you only one leg? Just the one. And the other? Went bad and was removed. What did that do? Titan, what hands you have. Is all the rest there? You may now get up and ask me a favor. Is all the rest there? Nothing else has been removed, if that's what you mean. Is that your face? I confess it is. What else would it be? That my way. Red? Purple. What hands you have. Is there grass anywhere? I see none. Is there no green anywhere? A little moss. Is it still day? If you like, there's no other word for it. Will it not soon be evening? Get up, Billy. You're beginning to incommode me. Will it not soon be night? Day, night. I often feel that the earth stood still one sunless day in the heart of winter, in the gray of evening. Come on, Billy, get up. You're beginning to embarrass me. Good God, don't tell me you're going to pray. No. Or weep. No. I can't stay like this for hours with my face on an old man's knees. Knee. Yeah. Get, get up, will you? For peace. Dora used to say the day I hadn't earned enough. You and your heart, you do better crawling on all fours with your father's metal, your father's medals pinned to your ass and your money box around your neck. You and your little hop, who do you think you are? And she made me sleep on the floor. Who I thought I was. Never could. Never could. But if I listened long enough, I'd hear it. That stream would give. A harp. What's this about a harp? I once had a little harp. Would you be still and let me listen? How long are you going to stay like that? I could stay. I could stay like that for hours, listening to all the sounds. What sounds? I don't know what they are. I can see it. I can see it clearly. What would you say if I took it, eh, Billy, and made off with it? What would you say to that, Billy? And there might be a, another old man one day who would come out of his hole and find you there playing your mouth organ, and you tell him about the little fiddle you once had. Hey, Billy, what would you say to that? Oh, singing. <laughs> hey, Billy, there, moaning to the winter wind, having lost his little heart. Hey, Billy! 